Hello, my adventurer, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, today it's a two-part Tuesday because the moon, which focuses our emotions, will be in two different zodiac races today. As we wake up, still in a fire sign like you, Aries, making you emotionally focused on your inner child, your playful side, your romantic side. And if you hadn't had a chance to go out and do something fun, even if it's read the comics, you might want to give the first half of the day to yourself in that regard. The moon is in chapter three, so it's the lightest part of the transit and usually the most fun. By this afternoon, the moon moves into Taurus, grounding the entire planet in an earth sign and also for you, bringing your emotions down into your body and down into your immediate moment. So if you haven't managed your emotions well, could leave you not feeling too great in your body. If you haven't managed your body well, this could trigger emotion. And this emotional hyper-awareness will be the transit for you for the next 48 hours. Now, as of this evening, the moon will be trining two planets simultaneously, which means I think we're going to be doing some emotional comparing and contrasting in our life. On the one hand, the epicenter of your emotions is your hyper-aware reality, how you feel in the moment. How do you feel at work? How do you feel on the way to work? How do you feel when you wake up in the morning? What's that like? And how does that relate to your self-esteem, represented by Pluto? retrograde in the house of soul capital and Saturn in Virgo your career so how does your day-to-day -day reality and lifestyle uh, affect your career and how does that affect your self-esteem and how do they affect your day-to-day -day lifestyle I think this is what you're going to process this evening now on top of processing today Neptune is ruling the day the Sun's in chapter 2 of Sun and Virgo so while you're looking at that trine with the moon and Saturn uh, and also the Sun during the course of the day you're also in a meditation state and this is of course around this month's topic which is that you're gonna have a paradigm shift when it comes to your legacy and career perceptions within the next 10 to 12 days so today a good day to meditate on where you want to see yourself in your career how do you visualize it can you taste it can you touch it what does that look like what does that feel like getting clarity is the first step and if you have any issues on what your soul really wants then meditate today now if you need some help with meditation, we did have an episode of Meditation Vibration go live yesterday with Julie Zipper. She's available exclusively on the Mothership at SoulGarden.tv. All right, Sag, that's all I have for Tuesday. Believe it or not, it seems like a lot to me. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. Soul.